people in schools are just uh, eating just atrociously. Within the next 10 to 15 years, 20 years, they're going to be the next group of patients. I think we tend to underestimate the public's ability to change if we're willing to give them the science. Now, as far as getting young men, if they realize that down the line, that eating these foods was responsible for the high percentage of erectile dysfunction that occurs, I mean, you'd end this in a heartbeat. Really, the foundation for which this whole revolution can take place is from a, a knowledge base of irrefutable science. And really, right now, the totality of the evidence is so clear. Present cardiovascular medicine cannot halt the disease, it can't cure the disease, it'll never end the epidemic. I think we're at a point now where it is absolutely unconscionable for a physician to treat a patient with cardiovascular illness who does not mention this option.